What will I do when you're gone? Who's gonna tell me the truth? Who's gonna finish the stories I start the way you always do? When somebody knocks at the door, someone new walks in. I will smile and shake their hands, but you can't make old friends. Can't make old, old friends. Can't make old It was me and you since way back when, but you can't make old friends. How will I sing when you're gone? 'Cause it won't sound the same. Join in on those harmony parts when I call your name. You can't make old, old friends. Can't make old, old friends. It was you and me since way back when. But you can't. Saint Peter opens the gate, and you come walking in. I'll be there, just waiting for you. We all know the show must go on, but you can't make old friends. No, no, you can't make old friends. Can't make old friends. And you and me will be young again. Be together again, 'cause we both know we'll still be old friends. Mm -hmm. You can make old friends, mm -hmm. not the way we always been. Janet Fraser. Was an extraordinary person. She was kind, and funny, and talented. Above all, she was courageous. Try as I might, I could not find the words to honor her, to do justice to her life. Thankfully, I got some help. While words alone may not be enough. There are some names that might do. We often talk about those that give their lives in the service of their country, and while Janet Fraser did just that, that's not what her life was about. The following are the names of the men and women who did not die in service, but who are in fact alive today because of Janet. Major Samantha Carter. Dr. Daniel Jackson, Colonel Jack O'Neill, Tilk, Sergeant Connie Smith, Major Ian Hewels, Senior Airman Simon Wells. Our armed forces have turned the tide of world wars. 
young men and women from our great country's four corners have humbled history's worst tyrants. We carve our thanks in stone. We stamp it into metals. We carefully tend to vast fields where the men and women who gave their lives for our freedom now lay. More than ever in our history, we cannot fail to pass these stories of courage to the next generation. We must capture their imaginations while paying tribute to all those willing to die for the preservation of our way of life.